It's we're human. You get back up. Yes, I've been high up on the mountain. I've been blessed. But that's a slippery slope. And it's lonely up there. You know, people don't know that side. We did not come this far to just break down and lose now. I'm a winner. I'm going to win. I didn't quit. I didn't fall back. But I continued to fail and fail and fail. But it didn't matter because you know what? Fall forward. If I'm going to fall, I don't want to fall back on anything except my faith. I want to fall forward. I figure at least this way I'll see what I'm going to hit. Fall forward. But do you have the guts to fail? While it may be frightening, it will also be rewarding. Because the chances you take, the people you meet, the people you love, the faith that you have, that's what's going to define you. Keep working, keep striving, never give up, fall down seven times, get up eight. Ease is a greater threat to progress than hardship. Without commitment, you'll never start. But more importantly, without consistency, you'll never finish. It's not easy, so dreams without goals are just dreams and they ultimately fuel disappointment. So have dreams, but have goals. Life goals, yearly goals, monthly goals, daily goals. Don't confuse movement with progress. Remember, just because you're doing a lot more doesn't mean you're getting a lot more done. In order to achieve your goals, you must apply discipline, which you have already done, and consistency every day, not just on Tuesday and miss a few days. You have to work at it every day. You have to plan every day. You've heard the saying, we don't plan to fail. We fail to plan. Hard work works. Working really hard is what successful people do. What are you going to do with what you have? I'm not talking about how much you have. Some of you have money. Some of you have patience. Some of you have kindness. Some of you have love. Some of you have the gift of long suffering, whatever it is, whatever your gift is. What are you going to do with what you have? And it's not how much you have, it's what you do with what you have. Today is the beginning of the rest of your life and it can be, it can be very frightening. It's a new world out there, it's a mean world out there and you only live once. So do what you feel passionate about, passionate about. Take chances. To get something you never had, you have to do something you never did. I found that nothing in life is worthwhile unless you take risks. Nothing. True desire in the heart, that itch that you have, whatever it is you want to do, that thing that you want to do to help others and to, to grow and to make money, that desire, that itch, that's God's proof to you, sent beforehand already to indicate that it's yours. Aspire to make a difference. So you got to get out there, you got to give it everything you got, whether it's your time, your talent, your prayers, or your treasures. Because taking risk is not just about going for a job. It's also about knowing what you know and what you don't know. It's about being open to people and to ideas. You only live once, so do what you feel passionate about. Take chances professionally. Don't be afraid to go outside the box. Don't be afraid to think outside the box. Don't be afraid to fail big, to dream big but remember dreams without goals are just dreams